Disclaimer. Please forgive me now for there may be mispronunciations in this video. The Papua New Guinea in Iguanodon is almost exactly as its name is described. It's a dinosaur-like cryptid that has been recently reported lurking in the rainforest near Tinganavudu, village of Papua New Guinea. The first known sighting occurred in 1999. The independent newspaper of PNG reported that a dinosaur-like reptile was seen on two occasions in the Lake Moray area. In western province. It was December 11, 1999 when villagers traveling in a canoe reported seeing a large animal waiting in the shallow water near Baboa. The following day, a Seventh-day Adventist pastor and a church elder said they saw the animal not far from the first sighting. The creature was described as having a body as long as a dump truck and was as wide as nearly two meters or seven feet. It sported a long neck and a long slender tail and was walking on two hind legs, as thick as a coconut palm tree trunk with two smaller forelegs in front. The head was said to be similar to the shape of a cow's, with large eyes and sharp teeth as long as fingers. The skin was like that of a crocodile, and the creature had largest triangular scoops on the back. In March of 2004, the New Guinea Iguanodon was seen in a marsh just outside of the provincial capital of Kokopo. A multitude of news agencies picked up the story with the headlines such as Hunt for Dinosaur on Volcanic Island, The Age, Dinosaur Discovered in PNG, SBS, and the police hunt dinosaur-like creature on island, IOL. The special broadcasting service, SBS, reported, A police hunting party has gone in search of a mysterious dinosaur-like creature after reported sightings in the jungles of Papua New Guinea. Villagers in the volcanic island province of East New Britain said they fled in terror after seeing a three meters tall, gray-colored beast with a head like a dog and the tail of a crocodile. An eyewitness, Christine Sammy, told reporters she had run for her life after stumbling across the animal, which she said was as fast as a 900 liter water tank. I heard the people talking about it and went there to see for myself. It's a very huge and ugly looking animal. A government official said the villagers had identified the creature from books and movies about dinosaurs. They told us it was a dinosaur, said one official. The creature was said to have eaten three dogs which opposes what a true iguanodon would do since they are herbivores. Six police officers armed with M16 assault rifles and villagers carrying bush knives searched the area, but came up empty-handed. Kokopo's mayor, Albert Buenga, said the dinosaur would make a great tourist attraction. I'm not sure how whether or not they decided it was iguanodon. Maybe from the pictures in the book they offered to show the witnesses. Either way, the iguanodon is an herbivore and does live in swampy lands, which is where the creature is said to have been spotted. The iguanodon lived all over the place from Europe, North Africa, North America, Australia, and Asia. In order for the creature to have lived this long since its extinction would mean that there would be a population of them, but only two have ever been seen. This is not saying that the creatures that are cryptid related are not real. We found extinct animals still living amongst us, but are rare and very few in between. If you'd like to hear more about this creature, watch the first episode of Sci-Fi's television show Destination Truth. It's a great show, though it has been reported not to be entirely accurate in its tellings, but it's still a fun watch. What do you think of the Papua New Guinea Iguanodon? Did you like this video? Want to support this channel? Feel free to check out my Patreon page where I create content on cryptids, hauntings, alien abductions, serious killers, and much more. Can't support me there? Like, comment, and subscribe here.